What's happening, Middle Earthers? I am the Al here with some movie news. So according to The Hollywood Reporter, Peter Jackson is working on new Lord of the Rings films for Warner Brothers, targeting a 2026 debut. So this is some big news for all you Lord of the Rings fans. I'm going to read a little bit of what it says in the article. On Warner Brothers Discovery's first quarter earnings conference call on Thursday, CEO David Zaslav said that the company is now in early stages of script development for new Lord of the Rings movies, which he says they anticipate releasing in 2026, and will explore storylines yet to be told. The first film from New Line Cinema and Warner Brothers will be called Lord of the Rings The Hunt for Gollum. And apparently that's still a working title, so that may not be the final one by the time the movie comes out. But we know that the movie is going to be mainly focused on Gollum. And not only that, Andy Serkis is set to star and direct the movie. So Peter Jackson is not going to be directing this, but he is going to be producing it. Um, Zaslav says that director Peter Jackson and his longtime writing partners Fran Walsh and Philippa Boyens hope I said that correctly, will be involved every step of the way. Boyens and Wash will write the screenplay. The deal covers two films in the franchise. Okay, so um, I do love Lord of the Rings. I, I, I love those the, that original trilogy. I think it's one of the best trilogies ever made. Um, some of the best films ever made. Um, so yeah, I, I love Lord of the Rings. However, I would not call myself a middle, a middle earther. Um, I am not a super expert on Lord of the Rings. I have never read any of the books. Um, so I'm pretty much a casual when it comes to Lord of the Rings. Um, I did see the Hobbit trilogy and I did not like that trilogy. I didn't think it was anywhere near the quality of the Lord of the Rings. Um, apparently we're supposed to be getting another Lord of the Rings movie coming out this year. Let me look it up real quick. It's uh, The War of Rohrhim. Yeah, so we're supposed to be getting that. It's supposed to be an animated movie. So I will be watching that as well. Um, so as far as them doing more Lord of the Rings movies, um, I don't know how to feel about it, to be honest, because it seems like everything that's come out after the Lord of the Rings trilogy has not uh, been able to reach the quality that those movies were. You know, as I said, the Hobbit trilogy was very disappointing. Um, from what I hear about Rings of Power, apparently it, that's not as good as the, the Lord of the Rings trilogy. So I'm just hoping they don't, you know, try to monopolize this uh, franchise and try to make it into another cinematic universe unnecessarily. Um, it does get me some hope that Peter Jackson won't be working on everything by himself. And they're actually getting the original writers from the, uh, the, orig the original Lord of the Rings trilogy to work on these. So that's a good sign. Um, and I'm interested to see what Andy Serkis will do directing this. Um, uh, to be for me personally, I don't really care to see a Gollum spinoff. Um, that's one of the things I feel like is a bit unnecessary. Like if I'm getting like similar vibes with the Fantastic Beast movies a little bit, I'm hoping it doesn't tread that territory. Or even the Hobbit films. I hope we don't, you know. You, you know hope it doesn't feel like it's unnecessary that they're making this movie but i am slightly interested in seeing this because of andy circus directing this since he you know he does know the character he is the character so and he is a very solid director you know outside of venom 2 which i don't blame him necessarily i blame the script and sony uh, but he is a decent director so to get diff a different vision on this you know i think it will help it feel a little bit more fresh you know and peter jackson still will be producing so he won't be you know in you know involved in everything but you know i think there's some promise with this if they do decide to make more of these lord of the rings films um since i don't know a lot about the lore i'm wondering where what direction this golem film is going to be obviously it's going to be a prequel so it's going to be new territory for me so I'm interested to see where they're going to go with this and then whatever movies they want to do after that. But, you know, in general, like, am I super excited for this? No, but 
you you know you caught my curiosity i am intrigued to see what they'll do with this um hopefully everything works out but that's how i feel about this news what do you guys think about it do you guys are you guys fans of lord of the rings um do you guys want to see more from this franchise do you want more movies more shows how did you guys feel about the stuff that came out after lord of the rings like the hobbit and rings of power are you guys excited for the animated movie coming out later this year the war of Rahim? i know i butchered that name so badly i'm sorry don't come after me middle earthers but yeah let me know your thoughts down below